Wilmar Fernando Navarro, man of God, you know, I've, I've, I met you in New Jersey and I know you're in Florida now. Haven't, so right now I pray for you, Prophet Wilmar. I see you holding a sword, a large sword in your right hand. And the Lord, you know, this word that I preach today, it is for you, Propheta. Okay, it is for you. And I really see the Lord uh, upgrading your discernment. And there are certain people, Prophet Wilmar, for you to really begin to listen to and tap into. Like Jeremiah Johnson, Charlie Shamp. These are prophets and ministers for you to really, and Tracy Cook, for you to tap into and learn and lean and glean from. And I really believe, Prophet Wilmar, that the Lord is going to increase your influence. He's going to increase your sphere. I see your voice getting louder. I see your voice getting strengthened. And not because you're you're uh, extruding more strength and energy in your voice. You're, you're, not, you're not running your voice out. But what you're actually, God is actually amplifying your voice okay god is amplifying your prophetic voice and your prophetic authority even now over you wilmar i release fire power now fire over you brother wilmar that you will rise forth as a prophetic judge in the land like samson like gideon even like deborah that you will rise forth as a prophetic judge and god's going to give you authority prophet wilmar even over weather okay i love kat kerr uh she's a good friend of ours she's also in, in florida but she has a, a ministry called the weather warriors where they they purposefully prophesy and pray against the the tornadoes and the hurricanes and the weather and they see weather patterns change and i feel like there's an authority and a glory prophet wilmar that god's giving you even over weather okay because the disciples were astonished even the waves in the window bay him so god bless you prophet and jesus i want to pray for one more